Hello friends, welcome back to Technique and today we'll be talking about the Android 14 update for the OnePlus 10T. So OnePlus 10T was launched late last year and came with the Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 chip and it had the Oxygen OS 13 and uh, it came with pretty good hardware as well and uh, it was available in India as well as other global markets as well. Now let's see how the uh, device has changed with Android 14 and Oxygen OS 14. So the update has been ruled out uh, at least in India. So probably in the next coming days, it will be available across other countries and uh, the devices. So let's uh, see how this looks like. Uh, so let's take the about phone first. So about phone and about device. So you can see here Oxygen OS 14 and Android 14. So this is OnePlus 10T and you can see that the Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 chip. And if you see Android version is 14 and uh, the security patch is from November 2023. So it has the latest security patch and Android version is now updated to Android 14. So let's see how good are the experience is with the, the new update. So let's see what all features it has now. So first let's have a look at the UI. So if you uh, swipe uh, from the top, you can see the notification toggle. So here you, can, you don't see much of a difference. It's almost the same. Uh, then uh, if you uh, talk about the shelf, so shelf has uh, new features including much better experience and new widgets are also included so you can just access the widgets here so new widgets and new fresher look and much better experience there is also the global search so it is definitely improved now if you look at the app drawer here we don't see any sort of uh, changes it looks more or less similar and the experience is very smooth and not much of difference here now if you go to settings panel uh, you can see that uh, the icons are pretty neatly arranged and looks pretty much uh, compact and uh, easy to access and use. So it's the, um, uh, the aquamorphic design uh, which uh, OnePlus has got in with this update and it is more refined actually it is much easier to navigate and it has al already uh, the Oppo's uh, color OS style UI so that is not changed here but uh, the aquamorphic design looks pretty good and there are also a lot of system improvements performance improvement multitasking memory management all these have improved with uh, the new uh, oneplus uh, uh, performance improvement and there is also improvement uh, in terms of security and privacy so passwords and security privacy has been merged at security privacy and then uh, we have uh, a uh, lot of improvements as well in terms of security and privacy options so it's much more secure device now you also get this search here uh, the search for apps and other files so you can do that from here let's go to the other uh, features so uh, first step uh, we have uh, uh, let's go to the special features and here we have the smart sidebar so once you enable the smart sidebar you get this file doc functionality so we have talked about file doc in our uh, previous video of the oxygen 14 so file doc uh, is basically uh, kind of a clipboard functionality where you can uh, drop files which you want to share to other apps or to other devices uh, which are uh, uh, synced with uh, the oneplus account so you can uh, actually uh, sync to the cloud using the oneplus account and access the files uh, across devices like tablets uh, and other oneplus smartphones so that is available so you can access it from uh, here so if you just swipe here you can see that the file doc functionality now uh, uh, you can actually uh, copy uh, and uh, transfer other files from uh, this for example if i want to transfer a media file just select this file and then if i drag i can see here release to the file doc so now that file is uh, available in the file doc and from this file doc it can be accessed in any other application for example if i go to the uh, email and click uh, compose i can uh, access the file doc there you go and uh, drag and drop this file so this is how you can uh, access the file doc so it's a very useful functionality especially if you are using multiple oneplus devices you can sync it across the devices and easily access it now another functionality is uh, the cutout functionality so i'll just show you that functionality so you just press here and the image will be cut out and here also you can uh, add it to the file doc now i have added to the file doc apart from that you can also save this file so there you go I can save it as a new file, the cutout alone. So there you go. Now I have saved the cutout alone. So this is a new functionality. Apart from that, you can also access text from images. That functionality is also there. Then there are some improvements to the note application. And uh, these are some uh, improvements and new features. So we'll just uh, also show you the uh, change log of this uh, uh, 
experience so we'll just go here and i'll just show you the change log here so you can see that uh, add uh, adds a fluid cloud we'll talk about that in a while then uh, there are smart efficiency file that doc contact content extraction and smart cutout uh, cross device compatible connectivity and then security and privacy we have talked about that performance improvement and then aquamorphic design is there in the aquamorphic design one thing uh, which uh, we missed uh, is uh, uh the here we'll just go to the aod so you can see here carbon footprint aod this has been added so as i talked about this in previous video as well uh, the more you walk uh, the carbon footprint uh, is lesser so it counts the step and uh, taken by you and uh, it tells you how much of carbon footprint you were able to uh, save reduce or other reduce so there are three wallpapers or other aods uh, with this carbon footprint thing and apart from that uh, we also have this fluid cloud so you get uh, some notifications here i will just go to the clock and set a timer so i just set the timer and if i minimize you can see this the fluid cloud available so this works for calls uh, recording and other other uh, applications as well so if you just uh, tap and hold you can see this is the uh, timer running i can just uh, close it or uh, stop it and like if you just tap on it it will maximize so this is the uh, the new uh, fluid cloud functionality now if you look at the other options uh, there is not much of change if you look at the camera ui more or less similar not uh, much of things have changed here but uh, overall uh, uh, we are quite happy with what uh, oneplus has offered with the oxino is for it but we are not tested the device after uh, the update we just uh, installed the update and uh, we are just uh, testing it in the coming days and we'll say uh, if there are any major issues we'll report that but as of now it looks pretty good even the multitasking uh, also looks uh, quite similar nothing much change here so the major functionalities are file dog then the performance improvement security updates and then uh, the cutout functionality and the fluid cloud so these are the major functionalities included with this update so this update will be rolled out uh, to all the OnePlus 10T devices uh, across the globe in the coming days. So in case uh, you have the OnePlus 10T, uh, do check out the update uh, and see if uh, any update is available and you can download and install. So that was the video on the OnePlus 10T update. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Do hit that like button and also hit the subscribe button for more videos. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you in our next video. Have a great day.